Only R2 Rio certification assures customers that a facility is operating at the highest possible standards. Certification increases customer confidence and retention. Certification ultimately provides that competitive edge to attract new business, improve the bottom line, and help recycling businesses stay ahead of industry changes. That's why more and more electronics recycling facilities are getting certified, a sign guaranteeing customers the utmost integrity and value. R2 Rio certification provides electronics recycling facilities with the blueprint to be recognized globally as among the most responsible in the industry. The R2 Rio certification also improves profitability. Productivity by organizing your work in the most efficient way and uh, with as much forth foresight, uh, you become more efficient. Uh, you attract new business because it is a recognized standard. Being R2 Rio certified enables a facility to attract the most qualified workforce. This is the triage department of a materials recycling facility where it all begins. Handheld barcode scanners are used to collect data from the recyclable equipment. That data, such as the make, model, and serial number, is critical as it is reported back to the client. Once the data is captured, technicians group the materials into two categories. The first is the repair resale department where the equipment is sent to the breakdown lines. The rest is redeployed back to the clients for reuse. Technicians go through a meticulous training process learning how to handle material in accordance with R2 requirements. One of the things that we're proud of here is the ability to train people uh, in conjunction with the R2 Rios uh, certification program and we've driven over 75 jobs in this facility alone in the last three years and much of it in combination with the state of Ohio. Employee safety is of top concern and certification ensures proper measures are put in place. We constantly are looking at our PPE to make sure everybody has the most protection, whether it be Kevlar sleeves to protect their arms from glass, or the proper gloves for their hands or work boots. And we're very concerned about the environment in which they're working, the dust levels or any other environmental issues that may have happen. Technicians separate batteries, LCD monitors, and TVs. They are then taken apart and each is systematically tested before being ready for recycling. So this is a quality control room and uh, absolutely something that highlights our R2 processes for resale. Uh, this gives our customer base comfort in knowing that all the material has met the key functionality requirements for reselling material according to that standard. Behind me we have our battery center where we separate our batteries by type and we uh, and date and we package them in accordance with our DOT standards so they're ready to ship to the next recycler. This is what enables us to stay in compliance with R2 Rios at a high level to be a high level facility. As part of our LCD testing process, we go through a, a series of testing where we uh, test for pixelation, screen burn, other cosmetic issues before we grade the LCD monitors, which would be uh, in context with the R2 requirements to sell the material for its originally intended purpose. We can um, go through approximately 5,000 flat panel televisions a month. The screens are then repaired and resold to consumers and equipment dealers all over the country. So you attract more business into your facility. Um, environmentally, you know that you're being responsible and you can show that to your uh, clients and customers. To get certified, start the process at www.isri.org backslash certification or contact David Wagger at davidwagger at isri.org.